Alright, I'm starting off the vlog in my closet. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today is Friday and I got off of work early because we're having, my company's having um, their little holiday party tonight. So I'm home now and I'm going to start getting ready. So I thought I would start vlogging here so that you guys can see my outfit, my makeup, everything. I have a lot to do. I have to like wash my hair. I have to do my nails because I didn't do it yesterday. So um, yeah, that's what we're doing right now. Alright, so I'm literally just curling my hair. Um, I was supposed to wash it, but it's raining outside and my hair isn't that dirty, so I think I should be okay. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just going to curl it and then do kind of like, like tie back the front part like I normally do. It's like a, just a go-to hairstyle, to be honest. It's raining outside, which is really random. Um, it's supposed to rain tomorrow, not today, so I don't know where this rain came from, but it's raining, so, um, it's gonna be really cold, and, um, I do kind of have, like, a slight, slight cough, so I'm hoping I don't get, like, more sick. Okay, I'm just gonna finish curling the rest of my hair, so I'll be back. These are the earrings I'm going to wear tonight. I think I, sh I did show you guys these um, in one of my hauls. So let me just see what kind of hairstyle I want to go with before I commit and ruin. Wow, these are really heavy. If I ruin my hair. But I just want to get like the vibe. So maybe I will do the ponytail to be honest. I kind of like the ponytail. That's all I'm going to try to do right now because I just can't with this stupid hair. So I'm going to pin this back using these little clips. And then we can finish the hair once the makeup is done and my outfit is on and I can figure out what the hell I'm doing. I might have to like YouTube some um, tutorials because I'm just like done. I do want to apologize for the lighting, but I wanted to show you guys these real quick. I don't really have time to do my own nails, so I picked these up. I don't know which ones I'm going to do, but I think I'm going to do these because these don't match with my outfit, but I liked them. They're like matte mauve purples in the glitter nail, but this is just classic, so I think I'm going to do these. I'm going to charge my camera, and then I'm going to start my makeup. All right, so I just finished up with my nails, and... Honestly, they don't look bad from like super far, but when you look them like look at them up close, you can tell they're like not professionally done. But I just need them for tonight, so like like from far away it looks cute. So anyway, I'm going to start doing my makeup. I have no idea what kind of vibe I'm going for tonight, but it has to be bomb. So, I did repurchase my Wet n Wild stick foundation um this was my favorite foundation over the summer and kind of wanted to bring it back so i decided to repurchase it and there's a fuzz on my eye oh my god it feels weird having like nails anyway so yeah i'm just gonna start doing my makeup it's honestly nothing you guys haven't seen before so i'm not really gonna like do a tutorial um it's it's like the same shit i do all the time so all right so i just finished my face i look really scary really white um but i think for today's look i'm gonna try to use Hmm. I honestly have no idea what kind of look I'm going for, you guys, for once in a minute. 
I think I'm gonna use the Norvina palette mainly because of the uh, like browns in here and also because of this color up here I think I'm gonna use that on my lid maybe some of this in there um, the dress I'm wearing is like an emerald green and uh, my accessories are black like there's no other types of colors so I wanted to do more of like a subdued natural glam look nothing with color or anything like that um so i'm gonna just go ahead and get started um with my eyes so really hungry so I decided to have some popcorn but the eyes ended up looking exactly how I wanted so I'm very happy I'm moving on to my face right now so um I feel like I'm running late <laughs> but I don't know I'm not running late am I what is it no Gus is running late so What's new? And then I'm just going to spray my face with some facial water. And I'm just going to wait for that to set. Okay, so this the finished makeup it came out pretty much exactly how i wanted it to the only thing is that my hair looks like shit so we're gonna have to figure that out right now but i'm about to change in a little bit so i'll show you guys my outfit in a bit <laughs> So it's Saturday and the whole house is sleeping, which is why I'm trying to be quiet. We're about to head out to LA to check out some bride bridesmaids of dresses. Um, I'm kind of just waiting around. I got ready pretty early. I'm literally wearing like the exact same cardigan from yesterday. Kill me. Sue me. Um, I'm really tired, but... Everyone is upstairs sleeping, so I'm trying to be like quiet, but um, last night was really fun. I actually had more fun than I thought I was gonna have. Um, my coworkers are like really cool, so. I don't know if I should take like a coat with me because it's like gonna rain. I feel like I should take a coat, so I might change into a coat because this is not gonna cut it for me. Um, actually, yeah, let's change into a coat. Alright, so one of my favorite coats is upstairs, so I'm going to go grab that real quick. guys so i'm back home now that was such a long drive it took us an hour to get home but 
luckily we did find bridesmaids dresses today so i'm so happy and they looked really good on everyone the only one that couldn't come today is my little sister so she's just gonna have to deal with it that's the dress we chose so i want to show you guys my outfit real quick because i actually really like it um and i didn't explain where anything was from my jeans are from Abercrombie. I really like these. They're really high-waisted and they fit really nice. And then this top is from Boohoo. Um, it's lit. It's like a racer back. It's like an actual t-shirt. Um, so I just tuck it into my pants. But it's really nice. I like the shape of the top. Um, my boots are really, really old. They're from BP. I think my mom got these for me, um, Nordstrom's. And then my coat, I am in love with this coat. This is the coat that I bought at Windsor when I bought like my holiday uh, dresses and that haul I did from Windsor basically. Um, I get so many compliment compliments on it and people think it's like really nice and I'm like, guys, Windsor, <laughs> it's from Windsor. Um, but it's it's a really, really nice coat and I love the way it fits. It's kind of oversized, but it still looks like nice. Um, so yeah, really like this coat. And then my hat I've worn before, I think. It's from Nordstrom's as well. So yeah, this was the LA outfit. And then, oh, I was wearing this bag. Um, I haven't worn this bag in a while, actually. My sister kind of stole it from me. So um, this was the vibe for today. Anyway, so right now I think I'm just going to... Honestly, I kind of want to shower because I feel really dirty. Um, LA does that to you. You just feel so gross. I really just, as soon as we found the dresses, we walked around downtown a little bit to see if there were any other shops and I just felt so dirty and I just, I just wanted to get home. So, um, I think I might shower because I feel gross. And then today's actually the Bath and Body Works candle day where the candles are like $9 or something. So I kind of want to go, but... <sighs> I just don't want to drive anymore. I'm so tired. So we'll see. Maybe, maybe I will. Maybe I'll convince Gus to come with me so he can drive. Can't even see it. I'm so excited. <laughs> Look, it's popping in there. Good. So, Gus and I are going to go out to dinner with my dad right now, but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit because I never dress up. Well, I'm not really dressed up, but I'm just wearing all black and then these shoes um, and then my coat again. So, um, my shoes are Louboutin. Pants are these leather looking um, pants from Windsor and then my top is from Brandy Melville. And then this is my makeup for tonight. Um, I am wearing Sin from MAC on my lips. So, very last minute makeup. Sitting in the new car. Really nice.
had a pretty productive morning um, for a Sunday. Um, I basically, as you saw, I had my coffee and then I just cleaned my entire room because it was so, so messy. And then I just showered, um, kind of got ready for the day a little bit. I'm not going to put any makeup on today because I just really can't be bothered. I have nowhere to go. I'm not going to do it. So, um, but I did want to show you guys the candles I got at Bath and Body Works. So let me just pull those out. This lighting keeps changing, so I do apologize in advance, but this is the bag. It's literally huge. So I did get seven candles, three of which um, I chose, three Gus chose, and then we just got one random one. So the first one I'm going to show you guys is one that I actually started burning, and this is Praline Pecan and Cream. I love, love the container. I think it's so pretty it'll focus there you go so I think it's so so pretty and it really does match the aesthetic of our room so yeah I got this one and it smells sweet so I like sweet candles whereas Gus likes more like clean refreshing masculine scents um, which I don't mind either but I like sweet smells so um next one I got Paris cafe We've had this one in the past and it straight up just smells like coffee. It smells so good and it's really, really nice to burn in the morning when you're like waking up and you have this burning in the back and it just smells like coffee, like morning coffee. So I really like this one. This is one of the one Gus uh, got. Uh, this is Mahogany Teakwood High Intensity. This one is really, really nice if you're um, looking for a gift for a guy and he has a home or Gus takes this to his office. So really really nice next one is eucalyptus mint also one of Gus's picks this one smells really clean I like eucalyptus in general so I think I might just burn this one too um, but it has eucalyptus spearmint lemon peel sage and essential oils so this is one of their new like designs this is Santa's workshop sugared snickerdoodle and I just love the top it's so cute and this one is really, really sweet. I love, love this one. We're actually burning this one downstairs in the living room already, but it just has warm spices, vanilla, sugared musk, and essential oils, so. And there are two more, if I can get them out. I think these might be some of the ones, yeah. So this is another one of Gus's picks. This is black teakwood. Um, which smells very similar to mahogany teakwood. I actually asked um, one of the workers there what the difference was, and I think mahogany teakwood is just a little bit more intense, whereas this one does have almost like like a more relaxed, I don't know, it's like, I think it's a more relaxed version. So if you don't like mahogany teakwood, try black teakwood. Um, it does have some lavender in it, so... And the last one we got was Sweater Weather. We've had this one in the past before and I really like it, so it smells so good. This is not a sweet smell, so um, I think the only sweet ones are the Snickerdoodle, the Praline, and I think Paris Cafe isn't sweet, but that's like a, f like a, a food scented candle, so, but the rest are pretty clean. This one is very, very clean. This is like a good in-between if you like... If you want something seasonal, but like your boyfriend, husband, fiance, whoever doesn't like sweet smells, this is a good like compromise. So this one smells really good. Anyway, that's pretty much all we got. I, we got like some coupons for a free gift. So the total for all six candles was um. $57. Um, I did have a 20% off coupon as well, so that really helped. And then um, they were on sale for $9.50, so we saved a total of $118. So $57, that's pretty good considering these are individually priced at $24.50, which I would never buy this candle for $24, $25. Like, that's insane. I would never spend $25 in a candle, but $10. I'm, I'm down, plus the 20% off. Um, how much were they? They were like seven, wait, I don't know how much they were. Wait, 760? 
$7.60 each, which last year the candles were on sale for I think like $8.50 or something, so there was a price increase, but I mean, what are you going to do? It's inflation, you know, th these things happen. Anyway, I'm going to put these away. I have to figure out where I'm going to store all of these because there's a lot. Um, and I think Gus is going to take some of these to his work, so... But yeah, this is the one I'm currently burning, and then we're also burning sugared snickerdoodle downstairs in the living room, which fills up the entire house, so it smells so good. Um, anyway, so right now, I'm just going to kind of chill out. I do have to kind of meal prep some lunches for the week, um, because we're still we're still going strong, we're, we're eating clean, eating healthy, and I just want to meal prep so I don't have to think about it during the week. Um, I'm gonna cook some chicken and then some like just a ton of veggies um, basically anything I have in the fridge I'm just gonna cook and we're just gonna prep for the week yeah I think I'm just gonna hang out right now see what this is doing maybe go chill downstairs because everything is clean so um, yeah All right please excuse my appearance I'm like a little dead inside it's really cold and it started raining really randomly and my throat just doesn't feel great so um gus and i came out to pick up some pho he placed an order and not pho i'm sorry ramen i actually really don't like pho anymore um but he placed an order for ramen and we're picking it up and i'm so excited um i feel like that might make my throat feel better so Okay. I, I could think I dig this. It's spicy. Is it spicy? Oh, now this is good. I'm so tired. Anyway, um so my Sunday is pretty much over. All of the laundry is done, the room is completely clean, um, everything's clean, my meals are prepped for the week, so I just, now it's just a matter of relaxing and enjoying the rest of the Sunday. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to do anything for the rest of the night, so I think I'm going to end the vlog here. So yeah, nothing really else is going to go on tonight, um, I think I'm just going to shower, get ready for bed, even though it's literally like 5 o'clock. It's like dark and rainy outside and I just don't want to be out and about. So um, I think that's pretty much it for this weekend's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, it, was, it was a good weekend. And I'm very happy that I took the day to kind of just clean, organize, meal prep, and just get ready for the week because it's, I don't know, the end of the year is coming fast and I just want to end the year organized and uh, just in the right in the right way anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this weekend's vlog and if you did don't forget to like subscribe comment everything the whole shebang as usual um and i'll see you guys in my next video